guess you can only have two outfielders in the power play. But let's get going here in the Czech Republic. First ball of the tournament. Yeah, this one actually grabs a bit of the back or the back side of Davitsi. And you mentioned, though, my leg, which is a bit of a risky one, but he wasn't able to get too much on that. I think that's a leg bar to get things started. There's the next ball. Not too much damage on the scoreboard yet. And now there might oh. be, because this one is launched. And well, that might have been six last year. Definitely a six this year. Maximo time. It's the first one of the Czech Republic. Now, this is straight down the ground. Fielder is coming around. He's not going to get this. It's going to be six more. Maximo. Second over. And he is going, almost going to take a wicket first ball. Oh, and that's <laughs> Dana Siswaran. You just back there. Yeah, have a look at this one on the replay. And, uh, yeah, just be annoyed that didn't stick, really. And he's getting on oh, a bit. Buddy. And uh, there's one. <laughs> there's one. And it's a big wicket of Davitsi. I said that he uses his pace selectively. Well, I think he puts the afterburners on this one. Surprises Sabah. And over go the castle. The first wicket of this tournament, Bohemian. They lose Sabu and Davitsi at 21 for one. First ball of the tournament. Driven away pretty nicely, and that's going to be four. This one is worked away as well, and this one isn't going to be caught by the fielder. That's Jahangir Ahmed. He uh, seems to be in the thick of the action so far. The batting, oh, here we go. He's got him. Good ploy, and that's Bullion out of there. Very good bowling there from uh, Romani. It's been impressive on his debut here at the uh, the uh, ECS. What right. a what a good moment for him! A couple of days, I should say. <laughs> and this one is short, and it's going to be pounded. And once again, we see a good hook shot executed. There's been a lot of runs going in that area at the moment. Maximo Mandaranga got brought back. Well, this is in the air. It could be a chance, and it is taken. Well, that's a really good catch, Davidson Romani. Well, he bowled well, and now he's caught well. I was a bit worried that he'd come in there and it might go over his head, but he was able to hold on. Oh. This one is launched as well. Once again, getting a bit too straight, a bit too leg stumpish. And take that. So here means business. Maximo, his first of the tournament. 29 now, and this one probably be four more as it takes a little edge. The mood is on strike. This is in the air. It's hanging, and it's been dropped. That's a sort of catch. That's Rohit Tashmoeni, who's taken some real stunning catches in this series. This was an easy one, and he grasses it. Yeah, I think he was worried, he's worried too much about the uh, stepping over the boundary. And then when it finally got to him, he just put it down. Oh, this one is skied. Now, who wants this? I think the beast wants it himself, and he's going to do it himself. So I thought the keeper might have been interested. <laughs> Sunita Udagalagi. <laughs> Uh, the Beast said, no, no, this is my wicket and I'm going to take it. And he does. So he comes back after the big filthy five whites with a wicket. So he gets Grover for 14 to score 76 for four. This one is skied and it's Romani who's going to come in and go back. Well, that's his technique. Tends to work for him, I guess. And so once again, a good catch removes another Bohemian's batter. Mahmood goes for seven. Hassan, well, he's earned that wicket, hasn't he? He's bowled very well so far in match one. And his last ball, oh. it's going to be another swing and a miss. They might as well run a bye. And they're going to get away with it. And they might, might try for a second. Again, just a bit of uh, a bit of inexperience there to not go straight away. But they do get away with it. So just a wide and a bye off the last over. As Bat, Bat doesn't meet ball. And they're going to finish with a score of 86 for five off their 10 overs. out there, Nanathi Swaran, who's facing up. Oh, oh this one That's shoots close. through. I think there's a bit of bat in this one. But, uh, yeah, it should be an interesting chase. This one's short again. It's going to be a boundary. Got away with this a couple of times, but this time, yeah, this gets a little bit too straight. Nanathi Swaran in this round. Well, hold that up for a second, because this is going to be a wicket, and Javad Iqbal gets it just right. Last ball of the over. We did go for a couple of boundaries, but... Uh, Swaran went to the well once too often. To the beast, who smashes it towards us, and that's just bounced inside the line. It's going to hit my dog. I think it's actually <laughs> gone all the way. <laughs> it's uh, come towards us, but I actually think this is six, and it's been called. So it is Maximo time. He's the first for a shokin. 
Oh, oh is this gone? It certainly went a long way. In fact, he's walked. So Aaron Ashokin gets a real peach from the tank first up, grabs a little outside edge, and well taken behind the stumps as well by Sahil Grover. That was motoring. And Ashokin, well, credit to him as well. He didn't wait for the umpire's decision. He knew he nicked it. He went straight away. So a big wicket. Ashokin goes first ball. It's 16 for two. Oh, he's got him. That's another wicket. Fantastic bowling here from Fahad. And that's Ahmed back in the sheds. He's looked dangerous, hasn't he, Farhad, so far? And once again, you see he's got these kind of lanky action. He'll angle the ball in, but then he's getting the ball to go away, and that's a real good seed. Oh, left-hander now. He's out there, and Selvin hits his first one, and <laughs> it's fielded, but he had no idea where this went after it hit him. Have a look at this. And <laughs> this is a very interesting bit of fielding. But what happened next? I don't think the fielder had any idea at all. Oop, there it is. No, it's gone. Gone. And this is a really good ball. Well, the tank knew what he was doing. He found the angle of attack. And Selvin, after almost losing his stumps the ball before, he does this time. It's a slippery ball from Ritik Tomar. And now another wicket has fallen. 23 for four. Selvin has to go. And so the beast says enough's enough. He goes up and he goes over. And he goes all the way. Maximo hasn't had too much of the strike at all. He's only faced eight out of the first. His far hat. And this is cracked and absolutely <laughs> smashed. That's gone a long way over the boundary. Well, he does bowl that kind of length. And it's the kind of length that can take wickets, but also it's the kind of length that Wickram Asakura can bang out of the ground. That's the biggest six we've seen so far today. This time, there is some bat on it. This will be four. Yeah, it's hit pretty well. And oh, it's four runs. Cut shot. Waited on it. Beautiful shot there. Well, this, oh. this may help because this is launched. It's high in the sky. And, well, this is what we needed. Well, maybe he was just warming up. 13th ball's the lucky one for Romani Maximo as he swings PCC back into the contest. <laughs> he just hits straight through the ball. As long as he gets his eye in. Oh. Now he's going to go after this and he could oh. be gone. Oh, no. Well, that's a nasty collision. Hopefully everyone's all right there. It'll be a single. They seem to be getting up all right. I mean, I don't know if there's no calling there. The... the Looks like, yeah, the hand, and that's that's not what you like to see. It's Amit Rai, who is clutching his wrist. That was a nasty one. He goes after this, the beast, but it could be trouble. The fielder oh. goes back, and he just pats it away. He just take the one. So at the end of nine, the score is 66 for four. And they'll need a magical finish, but they do have the magic man on strike. He goes, and he goes long, and he goes straight, bang. It is Maximo time. Six, and keeping him in the game. Goes again, and this time oh. he's going to be gone. And what a good catch that is. That's <laughs> just something else. And that's the 12th man that's come on. Imran al -Hark. he came on for Amrit Rai. He's only been on the field for... About two or three minutes, and he's pulled that out, and he's pretty much won the game for Bohemians. What a moment. <laughs> well, cricket is such a funny game. And Imran al -Hark, well, from the bench to the action. Hida Galagi needs a boundary. He needs one badly, and he's going to get knocked over instead. So Davitsi's on a hat-trick, and Bohemians, I think they're going to do this at the moment. Hat-trick delivery, two to come. You're right, he does swing, and he swings the ball. Kind of fouls it onto his foot. That could have gone back onto the stumps pretty easily. So here's the last ball of match one. And Madaranga gets a bit on this. It's going, and it's going to go out of the park. Maximo. Consolation Maximo for Samira Madaranga. So he'll finish on six. And there's not too much in it in the end. The result will be Bohemians 86, Prague CC 79.